Hey, today I want to show you some new additions to the website and chat room and also how to change your avatar. And so um, I've added a Moody Radio Chicago radio player here and I've added some new links down here. The green are other websites, the white are kind of part of mine. So I've added a login here so you can log into the forum and if you're logged into the forum then you'll have your account, the same account on the chat. And I put join for new members, how to sign up on the forum, where to sign up, a contact and a doctrinal statement right here, because some people come in and they ask about that. So if you have an avatar on the forum, then your avatar will pop up in the chat like this. So you can have your own personalized name and, and picture. Otherwise, if, if you just sign into the chat without being a member of the forum, you'll be signed in as a guest. Okay, and um, so, you know, it'll say like guest and then a number. You can change your, the numbers to whatever name you want, but you'll still be guest and you can't change your picture unless you join the forum. So, once you go to kjvforum.com and you sign up and you get approved, then if you're on the desktop style, uh, you'll see your name right here, okay, and it might be, it's it's basically the same place in the other styles, but you'll see your name, you click on that, you go to profile, and then it's going to take you to your profile, okay, as it is, and then you can click on edit profile. And then, once you're in Edit Profile, which mine's pretty blank right now, you go over here to Edit Avatar. The avatar is the picture, your main picture. Like your profile picture, it's your avatar. Now I have it set to a small size right now. Uh, 90 pixels by 90 pixels is the max. Okay, so it needs to be that much or smaller. Um, and basically, you'll click Choose File and find the picture that you want, and if it's small enough, then you'll hit Submit, and that'll be your picture. Um, if it's not small enough, then you can go to a website like this, PickResize.com, P-I-C-R-E-S-I-Z-E.com, and you'll click Browse here, find the picture that you want, click on that, hit Continue, Then it's going to give you some steps here. Step one, uh, go down to step two, resize your picture. Okay, and here it'll show the original size. This one that I picked, it's almost close enough. It's 10 by 10, 110 by 110. Uh, it needs to be 90 by 90. So if I cut it down to 50%, that's definitely small enough. I really only need to go to like 25% smaller. And then it's 83 by 83, so it's still under 90 by 90. And then there's special effects if you want any, or you just click Save As. Okay. You go there, I'm done. And then Save to Disk. And it'll pop up and ask you, uh, it'll let you download it. Okay, and then you'll go back to the forum and use that picture that you resized. So pretty simple, it just has to be a smaller picture. And then once you log into the forum, you come to the chat, you'll automatically be logged in. Okay, and it'll have your profile there. And you can make up, you can make your own profile and uh, people can view it. You know, whatever you put on the forum as your profile, people can click on to view your profile and see that. And so also under the main, I've now moved the doctrinal statement to the forum so I can edit it more easier. But um, there's supposed to be, I forgot to do it on this one, but there's also a login and a join underneath here, but it's down here anyways. But on the rest of the website, I have join and, and login, login and join up here. Uh, but that's about it, I guess. So thank you. God bless.